Welcome to Medical Dialogues. I'm Roshni Ghan. Let's look at today's top headlines. No more rounds of NEET SS counseling 2022, said MCC. In a major update, the Medical Counseling Committee has announced that there will be no further rounds for NEET SS counseling 2022. Thus, all rounds for super speciality admissions for the academic session 2022 and 23 are over, and the unallotted candidates will be getting their refunds soon. The notification issued to this effect by the MCC reads that, as informed by the NMC and Ministry of Health and Family Welfare, all the rounds of super speciality counselling for the academic session 2022 is over, and there will be no further round of need assess counselling for DM, MCH, DNB, SS seats. Hence, it is to inform all candidates who have participated in super speciality for this academic session 2022. that the refund process of all eligible candidates will start shortly US health body warns of deadly Marburg virus after outbreak in Africa Marburg virus which causes infection as deadly as Ebola has been spreading like a wildfire in Africa now the US Centers for Disease Control and Prevention has urged all travelers going to Chinuya and Tanzania to take prevention to avoid catching the fatal virus furthermore the health body is also sending personnel to help halt the spread of the virus CO2 embolism during laparoscopy procedure surgeon anesthetist told to pay compensation two doctors a surgeon and an anesthetist have been ordered by the Gujarat State Consumer Dispute Resolution Commission to pay 33.70 lakh compensation to the kin of a patient who died due to carbon dioxide embolism during a laparoscopy procedure while the physician involved in the case was exonerated from the liability Presiding member of the state commission R N Mehta observed that the two doctors were liable for not providing efficient services to the patient and their action led to an irreversible condition of the patient and her death on the next day suggests that it was direct nexus with the cause of death of the patient. New medicine found for treatment of heart failure sleep apnea. A new medicine is showing promise in treating heart failure, a common ailment linked to sleep apnea and a shorter life span. The drug known as AF130 was tested in an animal model at Waipapa Taumata Rao, the University of Auckland, where researchers found it improved the heart's ability to pump, but equally important prevented sleep apnea, which itself reduces life span. Professor Julian Patton, director of the university's Manaki Manawa Center for Heart Research, said, "This drug does offer benefit for heart failure, but it's too for the price of fun in that it's also relieving the apnea for which there is currently no drug, only CPAP, a breathing device, which is poorly tolerated." That's all for today. Stay safe. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe. and press the bell icon